All right, we're in the kitchen. Thanks we're in the for the kitchen. Thanks for the interview. That was awesome. That was really good. Yeah, you're a so, smart, funny guy. Thanks, man. Thanks. Um, so and you don't smell bad either. Like sometimes you do interviews with people. You know, you're really close. Anyway. Well, we got to be close. We're yeah. recording. No, we got television. cameras everywhere. Oh, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> so basically, um, you say you cook, right? Yeah, I like to cook. All right, cool. Um, I you, adventure. Adventure. You try. I, I push the envelope. I thought you didn't know how to cook. So. No, I know how to cook, but sometimes it's hit and miss, right? Like yeah, well, yeah. It's all yeah, trial and error. Yeah, right? yeah like the other I day, I miss all the time. Do you really? Yeah. Sometimes I do a recipe and it doesn't come through. I'll just throw that recipe aside and then see. I'm afraid come, of failure. That's come back I'm, again to it. And that's see. why you're successful. And I'm not, because I <laughs> fail and I quit. All right. You ever make shatter butter? <laughs> Never once. Never. Never. So I'm gonna show you how to make shatter butter. First things first. Okay. I'm gonna turn on my my pot. Um, I'm gonna melt down some. That's about a half a cup of butter there. Do we want to show the Show the masses. The so half that's cup that's a half a cup of butter. So I'm gonna just throw it in in yep. here really quick. Okay. Won't take long to melt down. And it's this a lot year, of butter. Yeah, but it's for a 24. Cookies. And this is what people don't realize. Yeah. When they're cooking with butter, they're like, uh, "Hey, that's yeah. a lot of butter," and it's probably. But butter is actually good for you. Whole butter. There's it's a, yeah. It's I a usually keto thing. yeah. I usually use ghee in my recipes. Ghee is like clarified butter yeah. stuff. Um, but. For cookies, I like to use because it got a little bit of fat in it still, right? Creamier. Yeah, you know what I mean. It Softer. comes out comes out a little like bit me. better. Yeah. Creamy and soft. Yeah. <laughs> so, Mr. Blundell. Yes, sir. Have you ever seen this shit before? Uh, as a matter of fact, I have. Yeah, I've just never cooked Chris, with it. Yeah. Okay. And 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 this is shatter. Now, shatter is uh, an extract. Shatter yes. is explain how quickly how you do the shatter. So shatter really quick is you take all your end or ends. You can do buds too, right? Yeah. Uh, most people use their shake and stuff like that. Shake is the shake left. <laughs> yeah, the leftovers yeah, yeah, and yeah. the little buds and stuff like that. And you have a tube. You stack that tube up. You pack it in, and you take some butane pretty much, and you can run it through. And it runs through, and it goes through all. It takes all the terpenes uh, off off your easy off your buds. Yep. Uh, and, and then it goes right into um, let's say a bowl at the other side. Comes yeah. Okay. The other side. And then you you're take, squeezing all the juice. Yeah, you're you're taking that. You're running this this uh, let's say uh, high high um, like a pu like I said pro, um, butane or something, butane, yeah. right? And you're running it through. It takes all that. You're kind of freezing it and, and and taking it all off into this bowl. From there, you take it into an electric. Can't use gas, or else you fucking blow. It, you know what I mean? Um, oh, well, those are the stories that you. Yeah, hear about, you hear uh, those guys because yeah, 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 boom, the whole garage goes out of the house, right? <laughs> So you do it on electric, well ventilated area. So right? yeah, this is good for those guys yeah. then too. This is the video you want to watch yeah. if you plan on uh, making your home drugs at home. So I got the butter here. You can see it's almost gone. I'm gonna shut that down. Yep. Because I know it'll it'll melt. So right now, what I'm gonna do here um, is I'm gonna turn my scale on, and since it's a half a cup of butter, I only want to use 500 milligrams. Right? Do you though? <laughs> Well, it depends, I mean, right? Like, listen, because if you're gonna if you're gonna be doing this stuff, this is my theory on it, right? <laughs> if you're right. Gonna, if you're We're gonna, gonna eat, do a thousand milligrams. Okay, yeah, let's get all the way in. I'm not fucking you're around right. here. I don't want you fucking around here. What we want to do is, like, my girlfriend does this where she's got like a whole bunch of food and she cuts it up, and I'm like, let's put it all in. She goes, no, we always leave a little bit left little. over, just in case. My no such thing. <laughs> There's, there's, never, no such there's thing. never too much, right? There isn't. All right, so I'm going to weigh this out anyway. Uh, we're going to use it all then. That's, all that's right? better. That's so we got a gram. Yeah. All right, which, uh, which is around Excuse me. 1,000 milligrams if you're, if you're using that weight, right? So right, right, right. you know that this butter here, it's, uh, so it's a half a cup, which is uh, half a cup is eight tablespoons, mm -hmm. right? So you know each tablespoon, I'm going to drop this in here. And to put it on my spoon, right? And each, basically, each tablespoon is how much? Yeah, uh, each tablespoon will be about 40, 40 milligrams, right? So if I'm using all of this and we're doing twenty-four cookies, right? It's uh, it's going to be each cookie will be forty milligrams. So now it's worth. By the way, minutes. whoever gets these cookies, you're welcome. <laughs> now it's worth that. I thought you were taking them home. <laughs> 
The things you don't know about Mr. Dean Blundell. No, you people know that I use cannabis. I, you know, it's funny because you, I, yeah, like, yeah, I, we I, talked about we talked about that yeah. earlier, right? And, and I was he, talking with someone and telling my story just outside today, where where we were talking about why I use cannabis. And yeah, is it? It's medicinal. It's, right? it's absolutely yeah, of medicinal. Course. So my a little quick history. I don't drink anymore because yeah. I drank too much. I'm one yeah. of those guys that just said, uh, "Let's gear it down." I got PTSD. Didn't know it at the time. Yeah. Uh, five six years ago, and so how I medicated was I drank right. And, and, and at first, it's funny because with alcohol, you don't realize the slow spiral yeah, of baloney that you go effect through. that you go through. Where you start medicating, and you medicate so much because you feel like shit all yep. the time. Uh, where you're dealing with anxiety and depression and, and the things that cannabis corrects or helps correct right. with therapy and a bunch of other right, stuff. Right, absolutely. It, it helps so, me hugely. Yeah, that's it, why I use it, right? Like, yeah, that's my why brain's a lot of us use it. It's so, fucked. Since I've started to use cannabis, um, uh, and I used it a lot when I first got sober. Yep. I didn't, uh, I say sober, so, but so, I just stopped so drinking. Wait, wait. You, you said you used it a lot. So, in other words, it brought you back your life. It, it took you away It took you away from the, the, the alcohol, one. Well, at first it was a replacement. It helped you, yeah. It yeah, helped it re- you. They call it replacement therapy. Right, yeah, but it helped you yeah. get away from it because you still needed to feel that buzz, I guess, because of the wisdom. I don't know. It wasn't I don't know. I needed to when feel I, the buzz. It when was I like got it was, yeah, it was when just... I got rid of the alcohol, it was like that for me. Was I smoked really? a lot more. Right? Yeah, because I needed that buzz. Because you're always a drunk, right? Yeah, you know what I mean. So you got that drunk buzz all the time, right? So you battled the booze. I battled. Too. Yeah, I had demons with alcohol, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I only drink beer now. But I'll do a shot, and I got. <laughs> I love guys that do that. Yeah, I used to drink a lot. It's, now it's, I only it's... drink beer. No, but I it's mean, the... sixty of them. But <laughs> so now, so now you see that shatter we put in has been perfectly infused. Yep. All right. So oh, yeah, now there's nothing left. Yeah, there's nothing. You can't see the yellow at you know all. What I loved too is I loved how you uh, put the batter on the spoon just to look. Well, no, I just because if you throw it right down on the reason what happens. Why, so yeah, because you guys got to remember, heat will burn off your your medicine, right? So oh, with this wanna... pot, with this pot being on the burner and melting the the, the butter down, yeah. it's going to be hot. So if you throw that, for instance. If I had this pot without butter in here and I threw that shatter in there, just dude, it's in. just going to burn out. You're not going to get shit. You're going to have a bunch of duds. All right, let's get to uh, the, the cookies. So I got one cup of all-purpose flour. Put it in. It goes in. All right. This is cool. That's the dough already made, so I, I did it in before. In this bowl here, yeah. I have a quarter tablespoon of cinnamon, yeah. uh, about a, an eighth tablespoon of salt, and a half a tablespoon of baking soda. All right, that goes in here. Okay, so I'm, I'm take, just gonna hang on. I'm gonna to take my. <laughs> you just put your bug. Hang on. We're gonna have to make them in there soon. Oh, I'll put it down. So um, you just want to mix this in, make sure it's all yep. together. All right, so that's all done. We're gonna put that aside. All right, now we're gonna make the wet. Um, See, it's just you dump shit in the bowl. <laughs> There's like a whole routine here, so, so I'm excited. Yeah, I'm so now, so now, I'm educating. I got three quarters of a cup of white sugar. Uh, you can use brown. So if you're going to use brown, you can use like a half a cup of brown um, and a half a quarter cup of white, and it'll it'll make the cookies. What a about lot. stevia? What the fuck's fucking stevia? Stevia is like uh, what? Oh, the stevia. stevia. Yeah, yeah, that's the. It's, um, it's the, 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 the can you sweet. That's yeah, I'm it's saying. a sweetener. Yeah, you yeah. can use that too. Um, yeah, I would still. Then I'd go like um, the other way around. It's for the hip. Yeah, I have a lot of customers that ask me for that too. So I got hippies? yeah, a bunch of them. So I got I got the butter here that's uh, mixed, mm-hmm. and I got the three quarters of a cup of white. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cream these together. Right, cream. There you are. Can yeah. I hold that while you? Yeah, cream? yeah, absolutely, perfect. Can I hold your bowl while you cream? <laughs> so as you can see, hold your bowls. As you can bowls see, while you cream, hold my bowls, bro. Got both of them. <laughs> oh, so you gotta you, you get it in there, so it's like a piece yeah. Almost. So it's almost like yeah. You know, you're creaming everything together. All right. Mm-hmm. So I got my butter all in there. I got looks that. Looks like looks like crushed pineapple. So see that on yeah, your, they on got the, the up top there. Oh yeah. So basically, mm-hmm. you want to cream everything together, right? You're gonna take a little bit of. The vanilla extract. I like to use beans, uh, but I didn't want to stop and grab a bean. Usually about a tablespoon of um, some vanilla extract. I love it, the honesty. I didn't want to stop and grab mix, a vanilla bean. You know, fuck, it's like 30 bucks for a shit. good fresh vanilla bean. Yeah, huh? well, how much is that then? How much that? Is that that's vanilla? like four bucks. You win every time. 
So once that shit's creamed, yeah, it's creamed. Fuck, right. I love it. It's creamed. Dude. Yeah, I got it. So I got one egg here, right? A large egg. I'm gonna put that egg in, and I'm gonna mix that in. And so, you gonna do this? You, you, yeah, go ahead, bro. Tell me. Go nuts. I, I feel ready. like this is. Uh, I feel like this is one of those exercises that um, you're good familiar at. Familiar with the you're men. You're good at, eh? Yeah. It's like, <laughs> <laughs> I feel like this is something that that is effortless. For me. So you, you see now it, it's got that beautiful yellow color yeah, does from it the ever. egg, cool. from the, the butter, the sugar itself. So now what we're going to do is we're going to add. Am I allowed the, to stop? Yeah, of course. Well, there's some things so, you can't stop beating so, when you're cooking. Right. No, you're good. You're mixed in. So now we're going to take our flour, yep. right, and our, our wet. thing, right, wet. And I'm going to pour the flour in, all right, slowly. Half a bowl goes in, right? You half first? Half first, right? And I'll mix that in. Right? Make sure it gets in you nice. We have any stuff. Maybe it's yeah, it's yeah, oh, vanilla always smells uh, nice. Someone uh, someone with a predilection like we have, is it good? I don't know. No. Fuck. I have no fucking clue. We should do a challenge or something. No, it isn't. I'm here to tell On the you show. Next, no, it's not? No, really? No. Is it like the cinnamon it's challenge like or something? It's jammed with alcohol. It's <laughs> Is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really? Yeah. I, know I, make, I know I make my vanilla, like, uh, when I do that liquid stuff, yep. I, I take, I take um, like, a, a nice, you know, vodka, and I'll throw the, the beans right inside the bottle, mm -hmm. and I'll just let them sit there, right? Like, you break the bean mm. open, you cut the bean, and you throw about two or three stalks in, the, in a bottle of vodka. And that's your, and then, that'll be yeah, your, your vanilla your, extract? Yeah, your vanilla extract, right? So. That sounds like a workaround. <laughs> <laughs> but you got to remember, when you're cooking with it, mm -hmm. it, it, it burns off the alcohol anyway, right? So you see how it's now kind of getting tasty? Yeah, yeah. Right? So at this point, I got a cup of oats and a half a cup of, of chocolate chips. Why gonna... so cheap chocolate? Um, because what happens you is they... over the, Yeah, I know, and it's not even that, because if you keep them in the oven at 350 for the 10 minutes or 12 minutes it takes, yeah. they become like... and Because it, it melts uh, all the chocolate, in, and then become like flat cookies, you know what I mean? Yeah, oh, mix that shit in there. So there is like... Because it's funny, you know, I, I think a lot of guys like me who are time savers, yeah. you know, like when we when we go and make something, like I, I cook a lot actually for my kids, and yeah. I throw all the shit in a bowl or all this stuff in a pan, I'm like, yeah, it'll work out. Um, and it never does, and there's a reason why it never oh, there's does. There's steps, there's steps. So baking, baking is a science. You know, it's not like cooking, right? Like, honestly, baking you're is you're a gonna science. You're going to have a lot of cooks that are going to be super pissed. You why? Keep, well, you're like, baking's a science. Fucking not like right cooking, it is. Cooking's for losers. No, 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 no. I didn't mean that. it sounded like. So, you get, yeah, you get in there and get it nice and mixed, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, so, basically, what, what I do is a lot of people use um, cellophane and shit like that, and then you wrap it and you make that little, right, that little tube or something. I just use a bag, man. Take a bag, throw it in there, and I make the tube right inside the bag. Oh, do you really? Yeah, man. Watch That's a super time saver, too. Yeah, exactly, man. There you go. How's so, that? Yeah, perfect. Is that good? Or yeah, am I, absolutely. Am I good? You're good. You're good. Because so, you don't really ever know when you're doing it. No, it's fantastic. It's nice, well mixed. So now... You to hold the bag? Yeah, I'm going to just throw it in there. Don't touch it. No, I try not to. I know to. you. I try not to. There you go. Oh, oh, there you go. Yeah, yeah. It's a, little, a little there for me. Yeah, no, I'm going to show everybody how to... Uh, how to do it. So usually I'll just take it and I'll work it out. Right? Push it across. Right? Same thing as you're gonna do with your your thing and I'll oh, open the incredible. bag. And I'll open the bag, right? So now you're gonna roll this Way thing out. Dicking around in there yeah, you're gonna roll this shit out, right? Yeah. Close up the bag, boom, goes in the freezer. Bob's your uncle, Mary's your aunt, right? That is unbelievable. And, and now it's here. This is the one that I brought. So well, that one's already toasted. This one's already been done and, yeah. and in the freezer. So let's say but in a kitchen, there's no such thing as a microwave. Um, do you want me to cut these? Yeah, if you want to cut yeah, them up, uh, let's do four of them. Give it about like... Four? Yeah, let's just do four and I'll show you. Yeah, like that. Perfect. That, that's that perfect. Yeah. That's perfect. Shit, so you once you cut them, no, it's okay, man. You're good. Well, oh, monster fucking cookies, bro. <laughs> Well, I don't know what I'm doing. That's okay, man. People have to people we'll have cut to them cut up. me a little slack. We'll cut them up. So what I do is I usually build them up like this. And I make well, a little more work to it. Yeah, you just don't cut the fucking shit up. fucking big. Yeah, no, you, I know. What I do is I make my little cylinders like that. Yeah. Right? So that right there is probably... Um, that long. So this one is 50 gram. Right? So it'll be 50 gram cookies, right? So 
I'll do the next one at you 50. Age, yep. So you they all get all of them to 50. Yeah. Especially if you're selling these. Yeah, exactly. No, this way, no, this way, this way, you know um, that each cookie is the same yeah. one, and each one will have the exact same amount, right, of, of stuff. Mm -hmm. So, like we said, we're going to balance budget. These, these are going to be, oh, so we're one over. So, so look at, I was almost 100% right with yeah. my cut, and you yeah, were making fun of me. And stuff. So, so basically, we know each cookie has yeah. those that 40, 40 milligrams. Right. Right? Because if I just eyeball these, one cookie is going to be bigger than the other. Yeah, you want to make sure yeah, I'm going to weigh one now. Yeah, that, go ahead. What is that right there? That's perfect. Yeah. And boom. See, look Who at that. Who cut that? that Who cut that? Mr. Blundell. Great. Right. How's that? So we got five. So right now, uh, Looks neat. Looks the, like oven, little, the oven is, is ready. Right? The oven is okay. ready. Uh, can I put them in? Yeah, of course. How right. long do you put these in for? Uh, so about. 12 to 14 minutes. So I got them on 10. Yeah. So I'll just go back and they'll be done in 14 minutes. 14 so, minutes. So uh, we'll be literally. back. In 14 minutes, they'll be done. All right. So that's hot. Be careful. You know and, and it ain't the magic of TV where it's already been done uh, before. Yeah. We actually made these. So we this actually is actually time. like hot to the touch. Yeah. As you can see, it's very soft, the cookies. Uh, still, look, you see? Oh, yeah. Right? They're oh, still it's soft. It's really? not like it's, it's uh, uh, yeah. like they're super hot. So we, we're going to let them cool down a little bit. Um, um, Thank so, you. So, yeah. Oh, I mean, well. now at least you know how to, uh, how to yeah, infuse but you, your butter. But you know what? I think a lot of people think short. Shortcuts. You didn't take any shortcuts, which no, is why I was asking it, those stupid questions. Yeah, but no, this is very important. Yeah, you can't take shortcuts. No, no. if it's you want an effective product. It well, yeah, good. right. You gotta, you gotta do it properly. One. Yeah. Right, and and, and it's all in taste too, right? Because if, if, if you skip fucking steps like that, and you take short, you're never gonna get the right consistency or potency or Bingo. the taste. Yeah. Right? I don't know. I eat with my eyes. Once again, well, each cook, each cookie is forty milligrams. Yep. Each, um, have a fun ride when you get home and, and, and try one. I will. Um, it, I usually eat one like this uh, if with a tea or something mm -hmm. before bed, mm -hmm. and then you get a nice fucking sleep, right? Yeah. Because um, like I, my mind, like I said, I do it because my mind. Yeah, never and shuts I think off, I, th right? I think a lot of people that are watching this, you know, yes, yeah. it's education because you learn how to do it properly. Yeah, but, of course. But you know, the, the the responsible portion of it. Sure, you can go and eat cookies with friends and have a good yeah. time Saturday night. But there are a lot of people, and this is why I, yeah. I use it. Of course, there are a lot of people that use this stuff because they want a real life food. That real life food well, is that, sleep. Yeah. The monkeys go away, and That's I get right. to fuck. Get and to sleep. you know, this is this is uh, a way. Like, I mean, you can use CBD cookies. You don't have to do THC. Uh, some people hemp? can't can't hemp. Yeah, hemp. There's so many things you can add to this um, to make it what you need to sleep. Right? Caramel. Anything. Yeah. Yeah. Caramel hey? cookies. Yeah. Why did you keep out? Why did we? Go <laughs> Caramel chocolate oat, 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 oatmeal cookies. <laughs> so where can people uh, find you, bro? Uh, they can find me, as always, at DeanBlundell.com. Okay. Wonderful website. We've got... Okay, cool. We're uh, an influencer-based site. We've got a lot of people uh, from Darren Millard to yep. uh, Todd Hancock, Todd, the Todd Hancock podcast. Mm -hmm. called the Todd Cast podcast. Uh, we've got the tour manager who's a fuck. Great guy. His name's Brent. He manages all the Live Nation tours. Cool. He does a coffee cast. Terrific. And then we just uh, brought on a new podcast. You like soccer? Yeah, like I'm soccer. Sure, yeah. Uh, James Sharman, Danny Dick. Yeah, yeah, that's and, right. Uh, I've seen that post. Craig that's Forrest, the guy yeah, I, yeah. Oh, even Craig Forrest, too. Yes, yes. He was a goalie for uh, Canada, was he? Yes, he was. He yeah, was a goalie yeah, for Canada, well, played yeah. in the Premier League. That's right, yeah. Well, thank you so Thanks much, bro. Thanks for having bro. me, brother. Appreciate it was it. amazing. Yeah. Um, have a safe drive. I will. Um, so, once again, Mr. Blundell at DeanBlundell.com. Um, or at at Dean Blundell on Twitter. Or yeah, or at Dean Blundell on Twitter. Or on Facebook. Or on Facebook. DeanBlundell.com. That's okay. it, right? So thanks, man. Once again, uh, remember my saying: uh, a recipe starts from a rumble in the belly, uh, heads north to the brain, man, and always comes from the heart with love. Thanks. And he have hasn't a, even had one of these yet. Have a great day. <laughs> <laughs>